Now today we are doing the last family of this letter that is the letter O and the sound is A isn't it and this is the letter which it wants to make a family with. Now what letter is this? It is X and do you know what is the sound of this X? Listen carefully it is X not S X you have to say X now say after me A X A X and A X gives you the word ox what is it not ox ox come and say children A X ox again these are two letters with one family sound yeah this is ox a and x it is a two letter word it is a two letter family word isn't it have you heard or seen this animal what animal is this this is ox isn't it it is not a cow it has two big horns isn't it cows will not have such big horns this is ox now this ox wants to make three letter words because it wants to make its family big but very sad you know why this ox can make three letters three letter words only with two letters from a to z one is b another one is f no other letter will help ox to make three letter words one is b another one is f there is no D, G, H, M, N. Nothing will help to make three letter words. So it is very easy to remember. One is B, another one is F. Now when B or B joins with ox, tell me which word does it give? B, ox. You must tell me. B, ox is what children? I'm going to write. You tell me. Yes, it is box do you know what is a box this is a box isn't it you can open the i'll make a lid opening one so you can open the lid and put something inside this is the box you have your pencil box isn't it like that this is a different type of box mommy has a box to put the cookies or bangles inside isn't it so this is one type of box now we have another letter here, F, that is fur ox. Now fur ox gives what children? Tell me. I'm going to write, you tell me, what is it? Yes, it is fox. You know what is fox, isn't it? You have heard that story also, the fox and the grapes. Yeah, it has a big tail and it is a cunning animal, isn't it? So this is fox and this is box so these are the two rhyming words which you have to learn in ox family bo is one sound ox is a family sound fo is one sound ox is a family sound understood so let's go to this word and i will show you how to write so this is a and the letter x x so a uh, you have to write like this then don't re remove your finger go like this back and turn and write if it is difficult for you you can write like this take your hand out and join like this ox now to draw a box first you make like this line and another slanting line join it then you make it down here from here down, from here down and join it and you make a handle to open the box. So this is a, or a knob to open the box. B is the first sound, isn't it? Then you write the family sound, that is ox. B is first sound, ox is the family sound. So this is box. Now we have the next one that is fox. 
it is very difficult for you to draw this fox so i'll just show you how to draw the fox in an easy way you can draw only the head of the fox first you make like this you make like this then you make like this and like this then you make two eyes here and you make it snowy like this and like this two big ears fox yeah f is the first letter ox is the family sorry f is the first sound ox is the family sound f ox fox now i did not give you the picture of ox you, this is the picture of ox isn't it you need not draw that let this be a family sound only ox is a family sound and the words with ox are box and fox this is only for you to understand what is the meaning of or what is ox yeah these are the two words which we learn from ox family now i will show you the page so this is ox fox and box yeah now students we already learned two fill in the blanks today we are learning the third one so it is a big sentence so take care to write uh, close to each other but always keep space while writing now follow your teacher now capital t h e what is this one the isn't it now keep your finger and write sir not sir now keep your finger and write d a g dog the dog keep your finger and write s a t what is this sat now read the dog sat keep your finger again and write a n a n the dog sat on keep your finger here again and write t h e what is t h e the now this is small t h e this is capital t h e the and this is also the so whenever you start a sentence the first letter should be capital that is why t is capital here the the sat on the now leave one finger space and put a dash slowly on the blue line like this that means you have to and put a full stop here that means you have to write a word here now before uh, when i taught you to fill in the blanks before i showed you a picture now there was a picture and so it was easy for you to write the fill in the blanks yeah the first one and the second one i taught you with the picture but now i am not going to give you the picture when you read the lesson again and again you will get that word by heart so i explained to you when i was reading the lesson with you this sentence the dog sat on the log the dog sat on the log so when you write l that is l a g and the full stop is here now read it the dog sat on the log so when you are writing again i want you to write the same way the so now you need not keep your finger but bring your finger down like this and write dog bring it down and write sat bring it down and write on then t h e then you put a dash then you put a full stop 
Now read it before writing here. The dog sat on the log, isn't it? Now the dog sat on a log. I showed you that day. This is how the do uh, the dog sat on the log. Yeah. This dog sat on the log. Where is the sticker? This is how. The dog sat on the log. But I won't be showing you the picture. You have to remember this. The picture is like this. The dog sat on the log. This is called the log. So without the picture you have to write. I am taking away the picture. So remember the dog sat on the log. Shall we read children? T-H-E the the art a dot a n an T-H-E the t up a top the dot on the top. This is the top and this is the dot. So now this is a shop and in the shop there are toys, isn't it? There is a doll, there is a bear or a cat and there is a small car. And in this picture we have a cart and for me it looks like a box. This is a box and there is a frog in the box as well. And here there is, this is the log and there is somebody who is sitting on the log. Who is this one? This is the dog. Now let's see how to read this lesson. Write number one. T-H-I-S. This is a, is a t -op -a top. This is a top. Number two. It has a dot dot. It has a dot. Now this is a top. It has a dot. Now let's go to this one. That is number three. T-H-I-S. This is a shop. 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 So this is a shop. Number four. It has a doll. This is the doll. It has a doll. Number five. It has a dog. So this is not the cat or the lion. This is the dog. Understood? Next, number six. T H E the fr og fr og frog is in the box here the frog is in the box number 7 the box is on the cart cart the box is on the cart number 8 the fr og frog goes what is this one goes hop hop so the frog goes hop and hop number nine t h e the dog sat on the log now this dog sat on the log children this is not number ten since there is no place, the line is continued on the next line over here. Alright. So this is this full is number 9. So now we are going to number 10. H E He. Now this is saw. Sir of saw. A card card with. This is W I T H is with. W I T H with a rod. He saw a card with a rod. That means this dog 
you know why it sat on the log because it saw a card here so this is a card this dog saw a card which had a rod so which had a rod so this card had a rod and this dog sits on a log yeah now let's read all the 10 sentences without breaking the word now you are big children so you must read straight away all right this only this spelling you must learn t h i s is this and here is one word goes and another one is with then saw then frog these are new words yeah and shop as well okay this is a top it has a dot this is a shop it has a doll it has a dog the frog is in the box the box is on the cart the frog goes hop hop number nine the dog sat on the log he saw a card with a rod now you must read this lesson many times so that you can read it fluently now we have actually this is an explanation of the pictures which are here this top has a dot this shop has doll and dog and there is a box there is a frog and these are on the cart and the dog is on the log so this is an explanation of the pictures now we, you have to do this page write the missing letters which is very easy pick the correct word for this and here you read these words which already i taught you so this is the end of this letter o the phonetic r and its families now here so in this you have to learn bob job mob and sub here you have card rod and pod all the three words you also have here dog log fog and jog this is stop mop and hop don't want this letter and uh, sorry don't want this word and don't want this word as well this is fox and this is the box so this brings you the end of the lesson and the words of o family now i will show you your workbook in this you have to do all the exercises connecting with o family so you have to do this page this page and this is the puzzle this is coloring the words which have o in the middle like this one and this one you have to color this only with the yellow color light yellow not anything else here you have to do this one you don't have to yes you have to do this and this one this as well but don't want to do this one so you have to do this one no doing this page i um, mean this exercise then you have to do this one you have to do this one this one this one no need of doing this one yeah that's it all right you have a good day children take care bye bye